The Martial Artist Series was established back in 1936. Over the years, it's brought us events like concerts, touring productions of Broadway shows, and comedians like the iconic John Mulaney. In the 2018-2019 season, the Artist Series brought us Jersey Boys. The show was so large it took four semi-trucks to bring the equipment into the Jones C. Edwards Performing Arts Center, which is not the usual home of the Artist Series. Usually, the Artist Series is housed at the Keith Albee Performing Arts Center. The Keith Albee is a Huntington landmark. Since May of 1928, the Keith Albee has stood proud in its home on 4th Avenue. The Keith Albee Theater, now known to us as the Keith Albee Performing Arts Center, was named for the Keith Albee Orpheum Corporation, a chain of vaudeville and motion picture theaters. The building was designed by architect Thomas Lamb. It was one of eight that he designed with a special atmosphere, with a beautiful ceiling designed with a blue night sky and twinkling stars. The Keith Albee Performing Arts Center is the last of its kind. In 2011, one of his sister theaters, also named the Keith Albee Theater, was approved for demolition in Flushing, Queens, New York, where it had stood since Christmas of 1928. Our beloved Keith Albee was one of many theaters in Huntington at the time, but it's the only one that survived the massive change that has happened in the way that people see live entertainment. The Keith Albee was built in a way to change with the times. During its lifetime, it doubled as a movie theater, showing iconic films like Titanic and Jaws. In 2001, they reopened their doors to the public after restoring the main auditorium after their popcorn room caught fire and damaged the interior of the building. A few years later, in 2006, the Keith Albee stopped showing movies for good when Pullman Square opened their branch of Marquee Cinemas. The four screens that the Keith Albee had at the time was no match for the 16-screen multiplex that was just a block over. Today, the Keith Albee is home of the Martial Artist Series and, is, and certain special events in the community. Uh, my name is Angela Jones, and I am the Marketing Director for the Martial Artist Series. Um, the Martial Artist Series is a performing arts agency. Mm -hmm. um, we're considered town and gown, town meaning the town of Huntington or the tri-state community, and gown meaning like the gown that you get at cap and gown. So it's a marriage between um, university and community. And we, um, again, we're the second oldest in uh, the country. We were started um, in 1937 and it was to commemorate 100 years, the 100 year old birthday of Mar Marshall College. So um, it's a feather in the cap for Marshall University to have the legacy. Um, what made me wanted to work for the Marshall Artist Series? Well, it's kind of a fun job. Uh, actually, the former director of the Marshall Artist Series was my professor when I was in grad school and she approached me because um, uh, she had an open GA position so I didn't really like um, it just kind of fell into my lap so uh, and I've never left. How do we find the shows or acts that come into the Martial Artist Series? I am not the person responsible for doing the booking mm -hmm. of the Martial Artist Series. Our executive director Penny Watkins does the booking um, but I know that she works with agents from all across the country and the world, really. Um, the Artist Series is 82 years old this season, so we have a really good reputation of, you know, because we're the second oldest organization of our type in the, in the United States. We're right behind the University of Michigan. So Martial Artist Series people know, and, uh, know it as a good place to perform, and we're known for hospitality, so we always have those contacts for repeat shows, like not just repeat shows, Shows, but repeat business with different mm -hmm. agents for new shows and then we're always um, you, you attend conferences and you see what's performing in other markets and it's how it goes. How can people get involved with the Martial Artist Series? Um, well, there's a variety of um, areas. If you are interested in the performances, you can um, be involved as a ticket buyer, whether you have season tickets or whether you just buy tickets to uh, an individual show. That's one way to get involved. If you are a Marshall student, um, of course, you know, the majority of our shows are free with your Marshall ID, so we encourage you to attend while you're a student because it's more economic economical that way. <laughs> um, if you, uh, additionally as a student, we offer employment opportunities. Um, 
we hire interns and student assistants. Um, so that's a way to be involved. And um, we also have um, all of the ushers that work the shows at the Keith Alley are volunteer ushers. Nobody is paid for that. So um, that is an opportunity as well if you would like to um, volunteer your time being an usher.